see this face before previous video yeah i gotta get it in where i can you know can't waste a nice face if you like this look go ahead and check out my previous video that's uploaded should definitely be up by now but anyway we're here for fragrances today so let's go ahead and get into it hey fashion lovers welcome back it's my first time doing a fragrance video so for everyone actually this would be a welcome but if this is not your first time welcome back if this is your first time joining shawnee fashion that is i welcome 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 on my channel i focus on beauty lifestyle and i focus on a little bit of vlogs here and there all right go ahead and hit that like button and go ahead and subscribe for more there's that notification bell you know to keep you updated on all the things that i have coming up and of course you can feel free to share my content so let's go ahead and get into it in no particular order like i said first time doing a fragrance um, video so please bear with me but these are some of the fragrances that i am reaching for and have reached for so far this fall season so give me some grace as i go in and describe them um this is all my opinion none of this has been sponsored um in any capacity so we are going to start with tom ford's lost cherry yes so tom ford this oh just absolutely love it this is actually it's um top notes is going to be your sour cherry bitter almond um and liqueur middle note is going to be your sour cherry plum turkish rose and jasmine and then your base is going to be like a tonka bean va um, vanilla peru balsam um a lot of that <laughs> cinnamon sandalwood cedarwood cloves vetiver and patchouli this is if you're looking for something to pair your fragrances with for the fall when excuse me yeah actually any season this is it it does not have good lasting power so you definitely want to travel with the travel size when i do have a travel size but i'm i don't i didn't bring it over here but anyway um it is great to pair i pair this uh, with my um, gentle fluidity gold by mfk um there are a lot of fragrances um that i don't have but i have seen a lot of people um pairing it with it if i could just describe this i would just say sexy uh, definitely you will want to have this for a date night um, and I have my little notes right here so it could kind of guide me as I'm helping you all so I said I see date night where there's close contact you know maybe you're at the movies are you going to like a little jazz lounge and you just snug it up under your boo because it does wear very close to the skin so when I say close to the skin that means it's not going to have that sillage where it's projecting where you're walking down um, the hallway or down the street somewhere or walking into a restaurant and the, there's a scent trail behind you that's not what this perfume is going to get for you it's going to dry down close to the skin so it's more so those you're giving someone a hug and you smell it behind their ear or you're snuggled up under them and they smell it in your hair something like that so this is definitely a up close personal type fragrance and honey sexiness in a bottle okay that is time for it lost cherry next up no particular order um i have another time for it but i'll come back to that one later this one is ysl's uh black opium <sighs> another sexiness in a bottle and you'll actually notice that a lot of my fragrances have sort of that similar uh fragrance in them and that is a uh, vanilla amber i uh, that that's where i am right now um i love 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 those fragrances so right now this is my black opium and it has um it's vanilla fragrance top note is pear pink pepper and orange blossom um the middle is going to be the coffee jasmine bitter almond licorice 
y'all it's can y'all see it just look at that so so cute and the base note is going to be your vanilla patchouli cedar cashmere and wood and like i said this is another sexy fragrance this is another date night going out to the lounge you or maybe you just going out with some friends and you just want to make yourself feel really confident sexy like that you know just or it's even great for um bedtime so i enjoy spraying myself down at night that's just me preference your preference it is what it is but this is a great um, bedtime scent to just spray yourself down just so you just feel nice comfy sexy um while you're just resting relaxing lounging whatever it is but very mm, beautiful again that's the ysl black opium okay next up is actually i gotta move really quickly okay so next up i'm going to go into my let's see where's another sexy 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 let's go into tobacco tobacco vanille by tom ford <sighs> Whew, this is i'm owning the night I'm very intentional about the way I'm walking. I'm holding my head high. I know I'm sexy. I don't need anyone to remind me because I can remind myself of that. Yes, so uh, with this tobacco vanille, it is a um, amber spicy. Top note is tobacco leaf. The middle is gonna be a vanilla ca um, cacao, tonka bean, tobacco blossom. Ooh, that smells so good. I love this and then um, on the dry down you're going to get a uh, dry fruits and woody notes and like I said this is a sexy statement piece um, whether you want to go out um, to dinner whether you're going out um, I would say this is more so of a I'm going to be out on the town so like maybe you have a pier um, where you live or a nice um, event that's going to be outside absolutely absolutely stunning I love this love 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 definitely great for the fall and winter um, and all these fragrances that I'm showing you um, are ones that I've been reaching for for the fall um, and let me go to another one let me say that one because that one's it's almost going and I need a new one. Oh, anyway, anyway. Okay, so next up, going for another heavy hitter. <sighs> Y'all, it's it's just oh my nose, it just makes my nose so happy. This is um MFK's um Maison Francis Kirk de Jean. I hope I'm saying his name correctly, but this is MFK's um Oud Satin Mood, and this is another sexiness in a bottle I'm it's a amber woody just classy elegant I own the night I don't need a reminder um you're here with me um we're here together we we just about to be out and about yes my head is high. I'm walking. I'm walking. I'm walking. Oh, you smell me? Yes, honey. That's me. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, you want to know what it is? Oh, you know, it's just MFK's ooh, satin mood. Oh, yes. Interested? Yes, I was too. Trust me. It's worth the buy. Okay, so that is our MFK ooh, satin mood. And now we're going to start to come into the, mm, going to go a little subtle and then we're going to pick it back up. Okay, so this is, can y'all tell my favorite of all? This is a year round scent. That's why for me, it's 
it's it's about going and i definitely need a new bottle but this is um nfk's gentle fluidity gold so they have a gold and they have a silver i'm not um smelled the silver but the gold one is more of a feminine um more of a feminine scent whereas the silver um i've always seen reviews of how it's a very masculine scent um like i said i've never smelled it before so i don't know but this right here absolutely beautiful you could wear it all year round and as you can see i've been wearing it this is absolutely one of my favorite favorite ones um this is more so of your scent if, if you just want to feel very nice calm relaxed um you you just want to feel comfortable you just want to know that you smell nice but you're not necessarily expecting the oh my gosh but you know you're still going to get it because it, it still has that effect on people it's absolutely stunning and again this is the mfk gentle fluidity gold okay next up are two fragrances that if you're interested in fragrance if you've been watching reviews um you more than likely have definitely heard of both of these um i have my preference of course you're gonna have a lot of people who are like mm, i like this one it's the og but to be honest, I'm going to start with the OG, but then I'm going to go into the one that I prefer more. And if, like I said, you're already into fragrances, you probably already know what I'm going for right now. But that is MFK's, which one is it? Baccarat 540. Yes. If you are into fragrances or watching fragrances, I'm pretty sure you've heard of this one before. This is your classy, I know what I want. I don't need you to tell me what it is that I'm looking for because I've already had it on my mind. Um, and if I don't, I'm here to peruse and I'm just going to go about my business. I can ask for your assistance when I need it yeah so this is one of a it's just it's a beautiful fragrance it's i feel like it's more so of mm, i don't really know how to describe it but it's like it's a love hate for me like i like it i kind of love it but I'm okay if I don't have it in my collection, but it is still a nice statement piece to own um, in your collection. This is definitely a, um, I'm a classy, I'm a nice um, boss scent, um, walking, you own the place, you you have people coming and saying, um, oh, hi, um, how may I help you? Um, why, yes, yes, I'll take your bags for you, yes. Um, where would you like them to be delivered for li delivered to you know but i love that one next up oh excuse me um for the um for the baccarat 540 it is an amber floral the tap um, top note is going to be a saffron jasmine and the middle notes are going to be amber wood amber green and your base notes are going to be um, fir resin and cedar so like i said this is definitely a classy casual you're going out with your girls for a nice brunch um you're going out with your guy for a nice brunch very nice um morning afternoon evening scent whatever um you're going for and also year-round scent now that was the og but this one is the one that i am absolutely loving it has that almond scent that almond it's just to me it's more of a subtle i'm here but I'm okay with stepping to the side, stepping in the background. I still own the place, but I don't have to be in your face to let you know that this this is my establishment. This is my corporation. Like, I don't have to be there, but you know I'm there. 
you know I'm there, but I just don't have to be the one to announce it. That's what this one reminds me of. And I absolutely love... <sighs> I just love this. I love, 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 I love it. So the top note is going to be bitter almond and saffron. Your middle note is going to be your Egyptian jasmine and cedar. And then the base note is a um, ambergris, woody note, um, and musk. And it's just, for me, is this one right here. Excuse me, let me wipe it down. Let me, let me wipe it down. It's just absolutely oh, just and actually this is the one that i'm going to wear um is this one i want to wear tonight let's see oh you just smell yes 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 so here we go oh oh jeez oh you're just oh now for me and my house i spray how i want to you spray how you want to but I do like to spray all the way down my arms, both sides. I like to spray my hair, and then I like to spray all like a well, yeah, like an S, like an S, all the way down to the ankles. Bring it up to the inner thigh. Bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it around. It's just spray how you want. If you just want a little spray spray i don't do the dab I, I don't i don't rub my um arms together in any way i just spray and then i just fan it and then i just go back in and i spray again till i get the the look that i, I mean the um the vibe that i'm wanting from my uh, fragrance and then we're done you know oh absolutely stunning now i will say though i love these the price points but if you're looking for some nice statement pieces to have i don't think you will go wrong with any of these but definitely definitely try to go and um smell these fragrances fra <laughs> excuse me definitely go and try to smell um these samples um at your sax um nordstrom um your high-end um department stores unfortunately i don't have those here so everything that i have was based on a blind buy but i did a lot of research i made sure that i continuously looked at different um videos suggestions on different scents um their suggestions and what they um got from the scent how it made them feel um different things like that now i will say are there some that i did a blind buy and i feel like mm, maybe i could have waited yes i do but do i still feel like i can get use out of everything that i have here and i would love to wear them at some point so I can make sure that I do get use out of them. Yes, for sure. But like I said, beautiful, beautiful fragrances. And let's just do a real quick recap. So we have our Tom Ford Lost Cherry. And this is a 50 milliliter. Okay, so that's our Tom Ford. And then we're going to go to our next one. And this is Tom Ford. This is the Tobacco Vanille. sexiness in a bottle <laughs> okay and next up we have our YSL in our black opium I believe this is a 30 milliliter um or maybe this I think it's a, honestly I don't remember the size um that this is but I did get um the size smallest to the um next up from the travel size and I have a travel size over there so if you are able to get a travel size of your perfume it's absolutely great to have um in your purse um whenever you are out for the evening or out for the day you just feel like you want to refresh even though you may not have to but you just may feel like you want to you have that option 
And then next up, we have Agenta Fluidity Gold. As you see, my favorite, like I said, we're almost out. Oh, just, uh, where are you? Oh my gosh, you all, if there's nothing else that you take away from being interested in purchasing um, any of the fragrance that I've suggested, if there's only one that you want to try, even if it's just to go to um, the store to smell it. But guess what? MFK has a great thing where you go on their website, directly to their website, you can actually purchase samples. Uh, I believe you get three or four samples for in US dollars. I believe it's about $17 uh, for about three three I believe three or four samples and you get to choose any fragrance that they have and you actually get to use that uh, money that you use to purchase the samples at a later time if you choose to purchase a bigger bottle so definitely take advantage of that it's worth it <sighs> this is the one gentle fluidity gold if there's anything else that you're interested in I'm telling you you will not regret it <laughs> you will not regret it you will not regret it gentle fluidity gold okay so next up we had our mfk's ooh satin mood um same thing if you get a sample of it you could put it towards the purchase of a larger size bottle and this is the 50 um ml let me get off my fingerprint goodness y'all see that look at just the juice just that ooh. That deep berry just, you know, dark of the berry, sweet of the juice. Mm, yes. And then you have your um, OG MFK, the Baccarat Rouge 540. And look at that bottle detail. Can y'all see that? The bottle is so beautiful. He really did a great job with um, designing his bottles. And then this is the scent of the night. This is the Baccarat 540 x straight. And I apologize, I didn't say that earlier. This is the x straight version of the um, Baccarat Rouge 540. So this is the OG. And then this is the x straight. This is more of an almondy, um, subtle um, scent to its um original Baccarat 540. So I hope you all enjoy our video today. Again, this is my first time doing a fragrance video. Please let me know what did you think. Let me know. Give me some feedback. I really appreciate you all checking in. And until next time, see you later, fashion lovers.